warning, this keyboard is super vagina. Please view at your own discretion. Hello and welcome to this review of my EZ Eyes keyboard. No shush, that's what it's called, see? It says so clearly on the box, E-Z. Z. This keyboard was a donation from a viewer. Thanks, I guess. Now, basically, I get three kinds of keyboards donated to me. Vintage, modern, and cunt. Guess what category this one falls in? Yep, you guessed it, it is cunt. Now, when you first look at it, you'll probably think, oh, it's just a rubber dome keyboard with big letters, and maybe it's just extra mushy or something. But no, this bollock bumblebee is so much worse than you could possibly imagine. I mean, I know I'm sometimes critical of keyboards for small things, but really, I'm not being an ant fucker here. Basically, everything is wrong with this keyboard. This thing should typhoid off and contract cholera. Let's start with the switches. Yes, of course they're rubber domes, and yes, they're very mushy, as you'd expect, but they're also surprisingly stiff, and it's very tiring and awkward to type on this. It's like typing on a swamp. I'm really not sure why it's so bad. Maybe the designers just wanted to be extra evil or something, because I see no reason why it'd have to feel like what I imagine it'd be like to type on a 90-year-old's boobs. Tuberculosis! On a related note, the stabilizers are also very vagina. The big-ass enter key, which comes with a very annoying single-unit backspace, by the way, uses two stabilizers, but every time I pressed it, it got stuck down, so I remedied it by removing one of the stabilizers, and now it works better. So let me just say that again. I improved it by disconnecting one of the stabilizers. I mean, what kind of grave branch testicle violin keyboard does it have to be that it becomes better if you break a part of it? The build quality is nothing short of offensively terrible. The licorice dick that came up with this really should have the head examined. It weighs just 323 grams, no joke, which is roughly the same as this Anides 65% low profile keyboard. It probably flexes more and even bends more than any keyboard I've seen to date. I mean, <laughs> what is this? Seriously? It's built so badly that the keyboard actually caves in a little bit when you're typing on it. <laughs> I mean, look at this. You can see it for yourself, right? I'm not making this up. What a cholera mess. And this is not even with the feet extended. Speaking of which, the overall quality feel is probably not helped by the quality of the feet, which is just laughably crap. They don't even remain in place, and in fact I seem to have lost one of them. They're just two little plastic flappy things vaguely stuck in there, and one of them keeps falling out. Whatever dog dick looked at this and thought this was even remotely passable must have been a huge scrotum washer. Fuck this goddamn turbo tuberculosis maximally cunt meatball. The cable is very thin, as if they even tried to save money by shaving plastic off of it. And it's fairly short too, which is unusual for a modern keyboard. Normally it's 2 yards, or 1.8 meters for those who have decided to join the post-Paleolithic era, but this one is only 1.3 meters, or 1.4217 front lawns, as it's still called in some parts of the world. The F11 key is also not level with the rest of the keycaps, and I've tried reseating it several times, but this doesn't seem to fix it. So my diagnosis is that it's fucked. I've tried my absolute best to come up with a genuine positive trait to this cunt canary of a keyboard, and I've had to think long and hard, but now I've finally come up with something. The caps lock key is stepped, and... Uh, no, that's it. That's all I could come up with. When the benefactor showed me a picture of it, at first I thought, how bad could this be, really? But then I got it, and I tried it out for a few seconds and thought, unfortunately, peanut butter. Another pestilence smallpox keyboard I have to test for a week. Overall, the only conclusion I can realistically come up with about this keyboard is, contract flying finch tuberculosis, this goddamn old Jesus plague pluritus vagina keyboard is fucking unusable. Stay away from this at all costs. Anyway, that's enough old whoring. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed it and following is a typing demonstration of me typing on this keyboard.